so four. Four? Yeah. No. I, I might have to. I didn't. I didn't tell you what this this dude told me. Perfect, perfect, perfect dome. I mean, no words come out of my mouth. No words. You're gonna I'm cry. I'm sorry. I'm gonna cry. I'm gonna cry on camera. Perfect tortoise right here. Radiated tortoises. You don't know how to speak anymore. Radiated tortoises. We're gonna have to sell some. I, I didn't want to do this. What is going on, everybody? <laughs> Welcome back to another video here at Blake's Exotic Animal Ranch. Today, you guys, I'm gonna show you why I have to sell all my turtles and tortoises. And to get to all the turtles and tortoises, I have to go through all the ducks, the baby cappies, and the big fat pig behind me. So you guys see multiple videos here in the back section of my building where we have turtles and tortoises. Well, the tortoises are not here anymore. They're on another part of the property. But here we have all of aquatic turtles, like wood turtles and aquatic species. So right down over here, we're gonna show you that we have some of these amazing albino red ear sliders. And these are actually not some of my personal animals. These are actually some that we have just on the site available for you all. So a beautiful little slider. You guys can check him out on the site and he's available. We have some absolutely beautiful hillerized side neck turtles. These guys get real, real, real big. So make sure you guys have a great giant pond for them in the near future. But for now, big 100 gallon tank, they'll do absolutely great or waterland tub. So some of you guys are probably like, is this just like a advertised video to sell your turtle and tortoises? Well, it is, but it isn't. We're gonna get into detail in a second and we're actually gonna go to some of my prized turtles and tortoises and we have some for sale. Why is that? There's an opportunity right now that I have to get some really, really, really cool turtles. I am not gonna tell you what the turtles are because it is not set in stone, but I need to get the money in my pocket. It's pretty much what it comes down to it. So yes, there is some turtles here that we have for sale. Like we have a ton of these beautiful Central American wood turtles. We actually have a lot of these guys available, a bunch of them available. We also have, woo! We have some nice common snapping turtles available too, all different sizes, but Let's go ahead to the giant tortoises and let me show you some of the prize stuff that we have available. All right, so we're here inside of my turtle and tortoise section on another part of the property. Here to the left, we have our red foot and elongated tortoises. None of these guys are for sale. And I know because you guys saw the title, I say everything's for sale, but it's not really everything. It's a lot of things, but we're gonna keep on moving back and we're gonna go and start with our first species that we're gonna have to sell. And this is a species that not a lot of people have and they are quite rare, I'm not gonna lie. But this species gets very large. It's the fourth largest tortoise in the world. People say that they could be the leopard tortoise, it could be a yellowfoot tortoise, and it could be the mountain tortoise. So this species right here is the mountain tortoise. So we have this beautiful Burmese black mountain tortoise right here. He's about 10 inches. And then we have another one that is right here that is about 12 inches. We've had these guys since they're hatchlings. They're around four to five years old and they're doing absolutely amazing. So the reason why I decided to get these two sold is because we have a group of four. Two of them that are inside of there, are 100% a perfect pair. My female is very large, my male is beautiful, and this species does great just in pairs, and they have a beautiful enclosure. These two, I would have to make another enclosure down the road so I could pair them up. I'm not saying that these are a pair. They're looking like they're actually both females, but I'm not too sure. So we're gonna sell them for the right price, and we can ship these guys anywhere in the United States. Obviously, we would like them to go together, so you can DM me on Instagram if you are seriously interested. They're not gonna be cheap, they are a pretty penny, but they're really, really cool. And the reason why I decided to sell some of these tortoises is because like I was mentioning earlier, there is a group of tortoises coming from overseas that are in the works that I've got a friend of mine that are getting. And the species, I'm not gonna say exactly what they are yet because I don't want to tell you guys yet because I don't wanna spill the beans or anything like that and it doesn't follow through, I guess. You don't wanna jinx it. I don't wanna jinx it. Cassandra's in the background. Oh, everybody that's asking where Cassandra's at. See, she's here, she works for me still. Everybody <laughs> thinking that she's just the world traveler. There she is. All right. So Cassandra's behind the camera, you hear her back there. She's there, she's recording. Anyways, so these are the first two that are for sale. It does break my heart, I did really want to keep them, but sometimes you have to move things around. These do come around and I do have a perfect pair. I can show you my pair real quick. Here, come over here. Right over here, they're inside of here. They, they just love each other. The male to the right, the female to the left, they're very large. We've been seeing some breeding signs and I really feel confident that in the next couple years, I think I'll get my first clutch of eggs and we'll be able to document that together here at Blake Exotic Animal Ranch. So now let's keep on moving and I'm gonna show you the other species that we are gonna sell. So as you guys all know, and people are gonna laugh because I have a bunch of friends that watch me and they always laugh because I talk about it all the time. Rhino clemmies, wood turtles, are my favorite species 
of turtle for sure i i admitted it they are my favorite species of turtles we have some plans with aquascape so greg if you're watching this you know what's up we have some really really cool plans on this back side over here that's why this side is kind of still dormant and not really doing anything because i didn't want to start making the enclosures until we make it happen it's gonna be some cool stuff at the end of the year what what, what do you gotta say Xander? talk talk your talk go ahead Xander, never, talk. i've never heard you use the word dormant before. yeah dormant means something that's not it's being a big moved. vocabulary word for you yeah i'm trying to trying to expand my vocabulary but anyways it's gonna be some really cool stuff over there hopefully and if it doesn't work out with aquascape which i really do think it will we'll make something really cool all right keep on moving along over here we have my eastern herman tortoises we have some love making habit over here these none of these are for sale great awesome species of tortoise for every family they don't get big they don't get small we have all of the wood turtle species here and they're my favorite and they're not really in the best enclosure we want to make their enclosures as much more natural as we can they have their waterland tubs they have their plants they have fresh areas they have fresh sunlight all that stuff and i've produced hundreds in enclosures like this but we want to make them even better enclosures and there's a couple species that we really want to focus on all right moving right along we have tarzan over here we'll never get rid of tarzan tarzan's hiding right now tarzan is an aldabra tortoise that is actually cashier so whatever cash wants to decide to do with Tarzan one day, that's his choice. So that's Tarzan's right there. And if you guys didn't know, Cash is my son. Moving right along, we have cherry heads and elongated. They're hiding as well. We're not gonna see them. Inside of here, all right, we're gonna pull these guys out. These guys are Florida grown, raised here since hatchlings, pure Sir Lincoln star tortoises. So if you guys are not too familiar about star tortoises, there are Indian star tortoises, which are the smallest species. Then there's Sir Lincoln star tortoises, which is the medium size. And then there is Burmese star tortoises, which is the largest size of star tortoises. I have the medium size. It's always been my favorite. I almost had a perfect group back then, but unfortunately I lost them to fire. This is the new group that I've been raising up. And as of right now, we have a 3.2, meaning the three males, two females. The females are not for sale. They will stay here at the ranch. One of my beautiful females right here, almost of size of egg laying. Absolutely beautiful. I love this girl. And then we have another beautiful girl right here. Beautiful, has probably another year or so. And then right here, we have three males. This male right here, unfortunately lost his value because when he was younger, if you guys remember some videos that we made probably three, four years ago, we had rats that came in and ate my star tortoise's feet. Well, this is the one. He has some messed up feet, but his back leg, his tail and everything else is perfect. So he's gonna be a good breeder. We'll keep him. So. No problem, buddy. These are your two girlfriends. Now, it comes down to these two right here. It pretty much comes to you guys if you're interested. One of these males will be available. Not everybody wants to breed tortoises. This is a perfect tortoise if you live in Florida or anywhere. If you want one, to have it as a pet. I mean, to have one of these gems in your collection is absolutely amazing. These guys are Florida raised here in South Florida, outside in the temperatures with no problem, only come in when it's really, really, really cold. So if you're interested in this guy, just let me know. Or this one right here, if you want a smaller one, if we want a bigger one. They're same age, different size. But it's pretty, it's, it's, this is like an auction that's going on right now. One of these two are available. And if I had to, because of the funds, not, not giving you guys any hints. I almost, I almost gave you guys a hint of what I'm getting, but I'm not saying it yet. If I need to do it to sell another male, I will, because one male will be able to breed with these two females and it'll be happily ever after. It's a perfect group, no problem. But I probably just only wanna sell one male. Now, this one's the heartbreaker right here. And I'm just gonna stand in this position right here. Why? Also guys, I don't know who told Blake to match today, but. Listen, this is beautiful. You guys like my, my swag? He, he dressed himself today, as you can tell. We're doing good. We got we got the Nike slides, the, the zoo shoes. We got zebras, giraffes. Orange. Zebras and giraffes, that's it. And the color I mean, orange. Yeah, and a blue shirt. What's going on? Tell me in the comments. And pink and green. Do you guys like my design? Yes or no? I think I'm gonna start rocking these kind of clothes. Should I make merch like this, you guys? You let me know. All right, get back to the turtle focusing. Oh, reason why we're staying in this position. You see this right here? A beautiful radiated tortoise. The most beautiful tortoise in the entire world. Very, very endangered in their homelands. In the United States, not too much anymore. Why? Because captive breeding. Captive breeding in the private sector is the best for animals. I don't care what anybody says. All those animal crazy people out there that say that animals need to be in the wild, well, you're crazy because the wild is disappearing every single day and there needs to be animals in captivity so that one day if we're able to protect the land and everybody is able to fight together we can protect land and release animals back in the wild but for right now there's no arcs all around the world all around people's backyards just like mine that have amazing collections so we're going into madagascar over here 
It's in my Madagascar collection, tortoise section. Why is there so many spider webs? I'm trying to get focused over here. We got freaking spider webs. All right, I don't know. Radiated tortoises. You don't know how to speak anymore. Radiated tortoises. We're gonna have to sell some. I, I didn't want to do this. I really always told myself I would keep this group forever. But the opportunity, again, that I am getting for these other turtles that are coming in, the last time I've ever seen this turtle come available was over 10 years ago. And that is a fact. I looked at the messages yesterday. It was 10 years ago. There is probably this many people in the whole entire United States that is actually keeping them and maybe even breeding them. And the other three that might be having them doesn't have the opposite or the other sex, which sucks. It's a very rare species. I'm not telling you guys a species yet until it goes through and we'll do that for another video. I really need to get the species. It's, it's really one of my favorite species. And if you guys are following along, you guys are gonna understand what category of the species it is. Uh, and there's another species in there as well that I've never seen before. I don't even know one person in the United States that has them. And all these things are coming from a breeder out of the country that is just getting out of the hobby. And we're actually able to get these guys and they're all coming with paperwork. So it's everything's legal. Everything's right. Everything's coming in perfectly. So I want to get my hands on them. Radiated tortoises. I have multiple, 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 multiple friends just in the state of Florida. Yes. And you guys. These will only be sales in the state of Florida only because endangered species we cannot cross state lines. Everybody else can, the radiates cannot. I have multiple friends in the United States, but in the state of Florida, I have the, probably some of the best bloodlines I could get in the state of Florida to get more of them if I need to. So pretty much what I'm coming down to is sell a couple of those and get the rarest turtle pretty much in the world or keep these guys and miss out the opportunity to get the rarest turtle in the world. Tell me what you guys think I'm gonna do. I'm gonna sell these guys and I could get some beautiful ones down the road. I'm not selling them all. Heck no, I will never do that. So we're gonna jump over. Another thing too, you guys, in my videos and all this stuff, I'm not myself on camera how I am in person. Blake's I, a clown. I'm a clown all day long in person, but then when I'm on camera, I'm like, hoo, hoo. put a freaking tux on and be serious. Serious. I'm not gonna be serious. I'm gonna be a jokester, have fun, live life, and show you guys who the real Blake is. And that's what we wanna do. Back on track. Well, he wasn't lying. This is Blake. Yeah, it is Blake. The not. animal thing, everything is it. But I try to be too, like, perfect sometimes. And I'm going to just be fun for you guys. I think it's going to be more fun for me and everybody else. All right, radiated tortoises. Let's find these guys. Are you serious? They're right there. I, I know that. I see that in there. I'll get two more over. I'm going to get them all, line them up in a circle. There's eight of them in this group. I think I'm going to sell four. Four? Yeah. No. I, I might have to. I didn't, I didn't tell you what this this dude tell me this is like talking but talking to you guys millions of people at one time he gave me an opportunity i cannot shut down and i don't want to go into my pocket money i'm going to go into turtle money and we have the turtles here and like we're going back to it these turtles are here and we're able to get them again without a problem so this girl right here <laughs> she's absolutely not going anywhere she's beautiful she's amazing and she's staying right here on the ranch that one either. <laughs> that one's not going anywhere either. I'll go, let me go. I'm gonna take her out to show you guys, but she's not going anywhere either. All right, this is another beautiful girl. Something about the yellow heads, they have my heart. They're, they're staying here. Yellow head radiated, they're staying right here. So don't worry, Missy, you're gonna stay here. I'm sorry that maybe your brother or sister might have to go somewhere else, but it's okay. All right, you two, don't, don't. What did I tell you? Yellow head girls, whoo, or boys, I don't know what they are. Fully yellow head, those are my favorites. All right. You guys stay there. We don't have to worry about them. They're not for sale. Don't worry about them. Everybody else is over here. So we got another big girl here. Boy, I don't know if the girls are boys. I can't tell you guys. They are unsexed, unfortunately, but they are big. Another yellow head. Yellow heads can't go anywhere. They stay here. Absolutely amazing. We raised these up perfectly. I mean, perfect helmet head. Look at that thing. Wow. All right. You stay right there, Missy. Don't worry. Yellow heads are staying. All right. So this one right here is a yellow head half yellow head but this one right here is a perfect tortoise perfect shell absolutely amazing if you want a tortoise in your collection that is wowzers right here this one will be available dm me on instagram serious inquires only florida sales only i would have to have a picture of your id to sell this to you guys only in the state of florida all right so this is one of them right here i'm sorry missy you're gonna have to go I'll probably buy them back from these people, whoever. I, I'm going to save your numbers. I'm just saying. You stay right there. All right, next girl is right here. She's the 
only one in my collection. Don't know why. Only one in my collection that has a tad of pyramiding. Naturally, it happens. It's not bad. I know Bridger's gonna say it's not bad, but she's beautiful. I mean, look at her in the sun. Nice, thin yellow lines. The growth is always growing. They're all around four to five years old, and she is absolutely beautiful. A little bit of a yellow head. I mean, she's great. I'll shine them up for you guys when they go to their new home. I show you guys a true color of what they look like. Beautiful girl. So this is another one, and she's big. I mean, she's a big girl. Well started, ready to go. She's probably close to six inches. Series acquires will get you guys measurements and all that stuff. So that's the other one. Reaching back. This is the other one right here. Another yellow head. I think all my tortoises are yellow heads because I kind of pick them for yellow heads. That's what I like. I didn't think I was going to sell them, but again, going back to the same thing. This girl, crazy. Thin lines, thick lines. I mean, look at her in the sun. Woo! Pfft, stunner. Absolute stunner right there. Beautiful yellow head. I mean, insane. Almost Hershey Kiss tail. Probably a female. Probably a female. I ain't going to lie. 50 50 at the end of the day check her out if you guys are interested let me know this is number three we had one two and three so look at the video and if you're interested tell me which one you're interested we had one two and three this is three right here that's available perfect circle right there and the last but not least oh this hurts me it really hurts it does it does but it's just i'm gonna have to do it you guys this last female right here oh my god she is beautiful Oh my God, perfect, 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 perfect dome. I mean, no words come out of my mouth, no words. Perfect turtle. You're gonna I'm cry. sorry, I'm gonna cry. I'm gonna cry on camera. Perfect tortoise right here. Hershey tail, probably a girl. Whoever gets these guys, we're going to be friends because I might buy them back from you guys down in the road. All right. That's it. One, two, three, four. No, she's staying. Can't sell her. No way. You can show her. I can show her. All right. Come on. Let me show you this girl. Oh, boy. Oh, yeah. She's, she's staying here. Even though she doesn't have a black head. It's all right. She's going to stay. Wow. Look at that dome on her absolutely beautiful i mean crazy beautiful but i mean they're beautiful you guys some of these guys so let me let me grab them one more time show you guys on camera here come right over here in the green grass we have one beautiful a lot of potential crazy crazy dome then we have two well well big started turtle right here beautiful coloration very large very very little pyramiding doesn't affect anything for breeding down the road then we have three crazy yellow head i mean the thickness of those bands insane it looks fake it looks fake it does it looks fake and then our four probably the best dome out of the four that we have available insane insane i know we spent a lot of time here you guys at the ranch showing you guys these things but it means a lot to me with these turtles and tortoises I really, really want to make sure they go to the right home. I'm not going to just sell them to anybody. You guys have to be experienced tortoise keepers for these radiators in the state of Florida. I really would like them to go to somebody that keeps tortoises already, that will have a beautiful garden to put them outside already, or somebody that already keeps radiated tortoises. Hit me up on Instagram for all the species you see available. The stars, the mountains, we can sell them across state lines anywhere in the United States, so let me know. But the radiates, Florida sales only. Is it worth it? worth it we have to sell the collection the reason why it's worth it is because the opportunity that i'm going to get is insane i do not want to give this up i want to produce this species and they're really really one of my favorites that's all i got for you guys today that's pretty much all i got we're selling the turtle collection obviously not all of them but many of them i wanted you guys to click this video if you enjoyed this video give this video a thumbs up subscribe to the channel put your post notifications on make sure you have them notified why I go live all the time on all kinds of different platforms and people are like, oh wow, I haven't seen you on YouTube for I don't know how long. Yeah, well, put your post notification on you guys. We post videos, I don't know, two, three times a week, shorts every single day, TikToks, Instagrams. We do everything on every platform. Check it all out. I'll see you guys in the next one. Let me know if you're interested. Everything that's on the website is available. I'll see you guys later.
Peace out, everybody. Hey!